morning. <clears throat> oh, I have a talk this morning. Um, so I didn't get much sleep last night. I just, I just don't like sleeping without Jake is here. Um, so, uh, I just woke, rolled out of bed this morning and came to do some work that I had to do. I had to, um, get a newsletter e-blast ready to send out. And I'm looking at pictures of my sister. She's in a sorority. And she's just so freaking cute. Like, look at her. She's this one. Like, look at her. So cute. And then at 11, I'm going to get my nails done. I haven't decided if I'm going to get... I'm getting my, I know I'm getting my eyebrows done. But I haven't decided if I'm going to get my fingernails and toenails done or just one or the other. I might just go ahead and do it all. I look a mess right now, so just ignore this. I need to take a shower. Um, yeah. Um, but I'm meeting with one of my friends. She's going to go with me um, to get my nails done. And then I have discipleship with Callie, the, our neighbor, um, at 2, I think. So that's kind of my day. Jacob is still asleep. I mean, it's still early. Um, so, yeah. So nobody judged my hair right now. I definitely just got out of the shower. I was like, I needed a shower so bad, but I barely had time to take one. I'm going now to get my nails done. I felt like I was gonna take out something. I don't remember what it was. So, uh, yeah, let's see what my nails look like. <laughs> what the junk? There's a car just out here in the middle of this yard. That was so weird. <laughs> About to happen. Take a look at them. They're terrible, terrible eyebrows. <clears throat> about to be new. Mm -hmm. Alright, got the eyebrows did, but they're way red right now. Have fun with that. <gasps> got my nails done. Gel nails. Oh, can you see? And toenails. And then there's Michaela. <laughs> She's a little bit sleepy, but it's okay. Yeah, just woke up. <laughs> And it's 11. <laughs> it's okay. We don't sleep at night. <laughs> we just don't sleep. We just never <laughs> sleep. So that's our life. We're going to the Wally World. Mm -hmm. Alright, okay, bye. Yeah, those are cool. Oh, look at it. the cameras. What is the big deal about cameras? Honestly. I don't know. Everyone's like, I have an icon. I have an icon. That's what I'm saying. I have an icon. I have an icon. Not. This camera that I have right now, this this is a Sony CyberShot, and like I've had this camera forever, and it's like it's re really good just for like this type of thing. Yeah. Okay, I'm looking for one of these things. Like it goes inside there. Sure. Are we here or are we I don't know. All the TVs in the world. Oh, it could be here with the memory chip stuff. Just dropped Michaela off. It was good hanging out with her. Like, that was the first time me and her have ever hung out, like, just us two. So that was good. Um, yeah, I got some avocados at Walmart. Like, eight avocados. Um, avocados. My memory, like, my memory chip for this camera doesn't fit into my computer. It's too small. And so I have a transporter thing that you put it into and then put it into the computer. And yesterday I just like overloaded my computer and I broke that. So I got that at Walmart and I got some dish soap at Walmart. We were out of dish soap because our dishwasher is dumb and doesn't work. So we wash by hand, which is cool. Um, wash by hand and so we were out of soap for that this past couple days like we haven't had a lot like going on and I'm just kind of getting back in the swing of things and um, yesterday I edited pictures all day long and so and then I had a session premiere last night and I didn't vlog any of it um, but that's okay we're, I'm still here guys don't worry I'm sure you're not worried at all probably don't even care um, you might though. I don't know. It's, it's like Mr. Nobody Cares. 
but I know one day these videos will be seen by a lot of people and they will see Jesus hopefully I'm gonna go I got to check the mail I just got home um, check the mail I wonder how many people like think that I'm weird for holding a camera out in front of me I really don't care like because for you it's just our natural life but for them it's like I'm in real life holding a camera in front of my face it's really strange maybe they think that I'm like making a movie yeah right <gasps> gotten mail What it is it looks like crap don't you hate that junk mail like has no point nobody cares i got to get my avocados avocado i was gonna say avocado i don't think there's an l in it there's definitely avocado i don't know avo avocado avocado whatever i don't know let's see is it written on the thing yeah, there's definitely no L in there. It's avocado. I'm silly. Walmart got new bags. Sorry this camera is like awkward. I have mail under my armpit. Ah, lifting weights with the avocado. Look. Ah, working on that muscle. Alright, gotta go inside now. Okay, I just cleaned out this, my, um, oh my gosh, the, my diff aroma diffuser. I just cleaned it out. I had some backed up oil on the bottom. To, I'm going to put, to put lemon and purification inside. Um, and this will, like, the house smells a little stinky right now because of, um, all the food in the kitchen. So, I'm about to drop some of these in there. I'll show you that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Definitely didn't mean to put that much, but it's okay. Lemon's always good. Purification. I haven't used this one yet. This is a new one. But it takes out smells. One, two, three, four. Good. Put the lid back on. And switch. I think I'm going to do it for at least an uh, maybe for four hours. Why not? And I love the puff this puff that comes out. I am preparing to just do discipleship with Callie right now. Um, so, and this is the book that we're going through. It's called Multiply um, by Francis Chan. Um, and the foreword is by David Platt. They're two really legit um, believers and followers of the Lord, and um, so this is um, just to help go through discipleship and like tells you what discipleship is. Okay, found what is a disciple. Um, let's go to the second paragraph. The word disciple disciple refers to a student or apprentice. Disciples in Jesus' day would follow their rabbi, which means teacher, wherever he went, learning from their, ha their the rabbi's teaching and being trained to do as the rabbi did. Basically, a disciple, a disciple is a follower, but only if we take the term follower literally. Becoming a disciple of Jesus is as simple as obeying him, obeying his call to follow. But like, essentially, like, we were called to make disciples, Matthew uh, 28 18 through 20 and Jesus came to them and said all authority on earth and in heaven has been given unto me go therefore and make disciples of all nations baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son of the Holy Spirit teaching them to obey all that I have commanded you lo and behold really doesn't say lo and behold I'm with you always Matthew 28 18 through 20 um, and so that is that's the Great Commission. That's what we are called to do is go make disciples. And disciples are followers of Christ. And a disciple makes a disciple who makes a disciple. And so um, I'm called to make, the disip make disciples. And I'm discipling Callie, who in turn will disciple another girl and another girl. Um, and the reason that she, the reason that a disciple follows the discipler 
is because they love Jesus. And the, when you're walking with the Lord, the closer you get with Him, you become more like Him. And essentially, um, they are following Jesus. They're not following you. They're following Christ in you. And so um, that's what discipleship looks like um, as far as like what it is um, and how you go about discipling someone, like teaching them and things you talk about and discuss, pray about. And that sort of thing is based upon the person, however you want to do it. Um, but it's from Scripture, and it's about God, and it's about the Lord. And so um, I'm not a very good teacher. I'm just not gifted in that. And so that's why I have this book. It helps me to go through this. And so um, we're meeting in just a few minutes to go over this. So I'm going to just glance over it really quickly. I've already read it, um, and I'm praying and preparing right now to speak with her and talk to her and just, just live life with her, teach her. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. I've cooked dinner, guys. Got some guacamole that is delicioso, and it looks grosso. Chippies, salsa, sour cream, and chicken enchilada bake. This has chicken, black beans, rotel, cheese, enchilada sauce, and more cheese. And Jake is just pouring us some drinkies. Drew is on his way over, hopefully, because we're hungry. You guys have seen a lot of me today. You haven't seen a lot of Jake, so. Hello, governor. Hello. Oh, there's, it's hot. Whoa. What do you want from me? You asked me to pour your tea. You didn't say anything about ice. Just like Specific. A, just like a couple pieces of ice, dearie. Pacific. Dearie. Babe, you gotta be Pacific. Pacific. Like the ocean. Oh. You're, you look like a, a table that has a little head. What? <laughs> I can only see your head. Oh, thanks for the ice, babe. Thanks, Deary. You think Drew will want ice? No. So you see the spider web in there? Like why it looks like that? Because it, I, I'm not worried about that. But why? Do you know why it looks like that? Um, because that's the way that it froze. Because it was cold water. No. Because it was hot water. Do you know hot water freezes faster than cold water? I didn't know that. Ha! Huh. Science lesson. It's the only thing I learned in science. I could put it in there and he'd never know. I would. Jake is just making a cup of tea for the guy that's mowing the, our yard. His name's Mark and he's a nice guy. He's about to take it to him. He seems like a nice fella. This is, this is an intentional moment. This is what I call intentional kindness. Intentional kindness. I've actually never called it that. <laughs> but, I've been thinking about Mark the past couple of weeks, and I haven't really said anything about it. But, seems like a nice guy. I don't know him. He mows our yard. I run him in the gym. He doesn't do like that. Um, but, I don't know if he knows Jesus. So, I just show kindness and love the dude and give him tea and share the gospel with him, so, later. Yeah. Preaching that grass on before he ate it. It is like, that just gets me every time. And like he will, he will come, he who I'm not even worried that he carried his sandals. <laughs> yeah. It's John the Baptist re referencing uh, Jesus. Mm-hmm. It's in uh, Mark. Uh, yeah, we're going over Mark. Who Are you recording right now? Yeah. Oh. Ha 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 awkward when she records sometimes. What is this for like a this is vlog? A... Vlog? Yeah. Vlog? That's cool. It's our life every day. Yo, so this is a uh, Greek yogurt. Kelan. Oh. 
We got the key lime this time. Ah, it rhymed. Key lime. Really delicious. If you eat terribly, you should stop that and eat good. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going to go to bed now. I'm going to grab a snacky, I think. Go to bed and go to sleep. Thanks for watching, guys. It was a, it was a good day. I actually vlogged today. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.